plus 10 in the rebounding category. That wound up being the difference in the first meeting last night. So off we go in round two as the teams clash again on a Friday night from Mexico City Arena. Capitanes in three home games since the Showcase Cup, three victories, and Shabazz Napier, see Al Pacheco in the starting lineup, and floats in Mexico City's second field goal. Misfires from deep, and Pacheco's got the rebound. Mexico City, they always like to push the pace. Here comes Kenneth Fareed down Broadway, and he floats in his first bucket tonight. You know, it's such an exciting matchup with Fareed and DJ Wilson. These two big men bumping back and forth together all game long. Should be a fun one to watch. DJ Wilson gets Oklahoma City in the point column. Shackleford will try a long three and misses everything. Beautiful pocket pass for Reed to see out Pacheco for the lay-in. Makoka into the paint through the contact and he finger roll finishes the right hand layup. He's done a terrific job with this franchise through their many changes in their early history. Napier takes the wide open three and knocks it down. And now everybody catches up. Mexico City in their half court. Here comes Mendoza. He finds Fareed rolling to the rim. Counted and a foul. Great offense as we look at the rebound here. Excuse me, the replay. Fareed gets the no. 2018, 2019, and Gianna. Yesterday was a milestone day for G Leaguers. It was the first day where NBA teams could sign G League players to those 10 day contracts. Because you're signed for a longer period of time with one single parent club. But these 10 days, you can go with any team, regardless of the team that you're playing with, if you're on a standard G League contract. For Mexico City's leading score, DJ Wilson turns, fires, finds an open Makoka. He misses. Wilson's there. They didn't box him out. The lead is eight. Woodard working downhill, a nice sidestep, missed the shot, but there's DJ Wilson with another offensive rebound and putback. Where NBA teams can sign G Leaguers, but uh, Derek Culver making his Mexico City debut tonight. Culver misses his first attempt in a Mexico City uniform, and here comes Woodard. Off the window and in, two point game. A very unique city, but a city that can offer him a lot when it comes to call ups. Already his fourth G League franchise. Mexico when City I talked about players that don't speak English, Yasel Perez is one of those players. I got to interview and talk with him. He flashes the leather, steps back. Napier into a crowd, loses the handle. DJ Wilson in transition, spins and misses the layup. But there's Scotty Hobson with the follow flush. And Mexico City looks a little out of it right now as the Blue have just been on a terror right now. Mendoza gets Mexico City a much needed bucket. Wooldridge has his pocket picked by Napier. Mexico City with numbers. Napier fires away and puts it in. One point game. Shot clock has gone dark. Hobson strolls down the baseline. Fareed blocked the shot, but Noah Starkey. Glad you're with us alongside Gianna Hearn, Chris Sylvester. Our entire crew, Scotty Hobson gets back to work, flips it in, plus the foul. Napier up top. Mendoza into the paint and floats it in, plus the foul. Four point lead for the blue. Napier got knocked down, it leaves Wooldridge with Fareed on him. And Kenneth Fareed says, not tonight, Mr. Wooldridge. Hobson inside again, and that bounces in. Napier has to hoist it up and misses off the back rim. Wooldridge skies to grab the two-handed rebound. Brings it down the lane, hangs in the air, and lays it in. Gary Clark yesterday had five three-pointers, five of seven threes. Really tremendous. 21 points, 14 rebounds. Oh, Let's Napier. see if he can kick in the gear. Starkey misses the runner. Fareed grabs the rebound. It's good. Shabazz Napier connects. He's going to have to step in for Mason Jones, all those points, and he's doing it right now. You know Ramon Diaz has told him, you know, we're going to need some help today. Kenneth Fareed grabs a second effort for Mexico City. 
Pacheco working downhill, high off the window. It bounces around and in. Loose ball gathered in by Wooldridge, and that's the easiest bucket we've seen tonight. Happening in night, as you mentioned, that doesn't happen until January comes around. So now teams and players, really, they're looking for those call-ups uh, because... DJ Wilson thought about the three, passed up on it. Now Gaddy drives, and Gaddy an easy lay-in. Side with their defense to make sure that the Blue can't get these easy points inside. Force them to shoot from three. Flipped in, plus the foul. Another and one, and this time it's Woodard. Wilson puts it in. And recovered by Makoka. Shot clock into single digits. And he lays it in. Just too easy of a basket. Again and again for Oklahoma City. Mexico City's gonna need to turn on their defense if it's gonna flip this game around and add some points. They're scoring and see how Pacheco is hoping that ignites the Mexico City offense, but Makoka nails the long range three. It's even harder. But that doesn't help. Yeah, into the backcourt. A fast break chance again. Gaddy pulls the trigger, splashes in the three. 21 point lead. Napier has not been in. We have seen Mexico City struggle more to get points. Kenneth Faree puts it in. Off the window, it's good for Kenny Faree. The Capitanes capitalize in transition there. They're going to need to continue to do that to chip away at this lead. Oh, Woodard silences the crowd as he knocks down the corner tray. Woodard finds Wilson. And Wilson, in and out, offensive rebound. Nobody boxed out Wooldridge, and he scores off the glass. The Napier, obviously not a rebounder, but you're in there. You gotta get that. At least go for it. Kenneth Fareed, look out below. The veteran flushes it through. It's the 8-53, 15-point game in the final minute of the opening half. Wilson just underneath the foul line and knocks down the open jump shot. Looks like Mexico City will hold until late in the possession. Maybe not. Not when you get a look like Kenneth Fareed did and he flips it in. Goose egg in the point column. He's missed all three of his shots from the field. Kenneth Fareed from straight away knocks down the triple. Abdul Gaddy picked up by Shabazz Napier along the end line, out to Woodard and deflected by Gary Clark. Loose ball to Wilson, and he knocks down the straightaway. For Mexico City coming out of the half defensively. You saw players going all over the place, getting a hand in the face there. Picked up by Kenneth Fareed. Takes him all the way to the rim and scores on the left to right sweeper off the window. Now it's Kenneth Fareed's turn. Picked up by DJ Wilson. Late in the clock. Fareed falling away. It's off the glass and in. Across the floor to Rigoberto Mendoza. He plays it back to Pacheco. A straightaway three, and it's good. Kenneth Fareed lays it in. Capitanes within 10. All we need to see is Gary Clark get on the board, and I think Mexico City will get something going here. Pacheco, step back. Good again. See how Pacheco. Here Thankfully, comes Pettis. Clark got in there because those are the possessions you don't want to lose, giving second chance opportunities when you're in a comeback. This is an impressive comeback. I mean, all comebacks are impressive, but when you're depleted, you have a back-to-back, -back, you don't have your best score in the game. Another miss, Gary Clark rebounds. There's been good offense, they've also been missing, and they have been hitting on the Capitani. Shackelford working downhill, uses the offhand to lay it in. Pacheco 
deep three. It's good. Mexico City takes the lead. But they made quick work of it out of the half before the fourth has even started. Mendoza all alone. And it's a three-point lead for Mexico City. Bigger point totals from other players on the team, Pacheco being one of them. Woldridge in transition, lays it in. Pacheco missed it off the front rim. And now Shackelford a chance for a run out lay in, and he scores. I would have loved to see Fareed do some work at that point instead of passing it out because his and DJ Wilson's battle has typically panned out for him. Way wide to the right. Shackelford fires, and it's good. Ignite team right now. Napier works downhill and lays it in. Mendoza bumping with Shackelford and puts it in. The short jump shot for Rigoberto Mendoza. Oh, Gaddy gets the bounce pass from Makoka. A nice cut to lay it home. Nice pass. That was very well done for the blue. Napier goes up and under, plus the foul. And give him one on the house. <laughs> Gaddy finds Wilson, and he connects on the short jumper. The Dominican Republic, whether it's Puerto Rico, whether it's Germany, it's just different here in America, the speed of the game. And there's a look at what DJ Wilson has. To contribute on offense to stay in it for the stretch run. DJ Wilson in among a crowd, out to an open water. And he knocks down the three. Robert Woodard. Shackleford hits the deck, missed the shot. Woodard has it poked away by Pacheco. Alfonso McKinney drops the hammer. Deep three, and Andreasi connects. Jay Wilson with a southpaw sledgehammer. Pacheco runs the show for Mexico City. Chris, I have a feeling we're gonna get down to the wire again with this game. What's amazing about that is Farid was on the floor, was able to get back up, get the defense rebound, and now we convert it into points here on this end. Late in the clock, Wooldridge out to Scotty Hobson. He fades, he fires, and fills it up. If you're going to go down a stretch having such a close game here in the fourth, there's no one more that you'd want to have the ball in their hands than Napier because he's one of the smartest veterans out in the G League. Napier, Gary Clark for the lead. Si, senor! All night, and it's a go-ahead tray. Pops in underneath, missed the... And you know he's feeling the pressure from the crowd at this point. He calmly knocks down the first, the 24-year-old from Paris, France. Missed the second. Clark rebounds. Picked up by Gaddy. Around the Farid screen, he draws two defenders, and it's deflected out. Chance of defense here in Mexico City. Gaddy inside, Wilson all alone. Will guard the inbound pass. Across the floor, Mendoza for the win. And we are headed to overtime in Mexico City. Mexico City resets with 10 on the timer. See how Pacheco. Layup for the win, it's good! C.L. Pacheco! The Capitanes find a way tonight at home against OKC, a look at the game winner. And I think they just didn't expect Pacheco was going to be the one. They probably thought he was gonna drop it off, pass it out, but he decides to take it in. 25 points, 11 rebounds, a monster double-double from him and a huge performance from Napier as well.
a bounce to DJ Wilson. Out to the corner. Woodard flashes the leather, lets it fly, and buries the three. With three points as well. Pacheco, high archer, long offensive rebound to Clark. Gary's got an open look, and he ties the game. A big three to respond to OKC's triple. We are tied again. DJ Wilson, no hesitation, and oh he puts it in. My. OKC to start overtime. Napier across the floor. Mendoza down the baseline to the corner. Clark again. It's good. Oh 